Grand Rising family, how y'all doing? I want to welcome you to another episode of Max Crypto News, where we talk about these intangible coins at all times, family. Listen, we're going to talk a little bit about Bitcoin today, where it looks like it's headed, on what can we expect, and all things cryptocurrency. Listen, family, if you're not subscribed to BitMax, I need you to hit that subscribe button. I need you to hit that notification bell. Um, so whenever I go live or I drop a video, you can get um the alert so you can watch it, family. Listen, um, we don't have that many black people that is in crypto, family. I'm one of the few. Um, I've been doing this for a long time, y'all. So we're gonna take a look at the chart, also, family. Um, I offer a cryptocurrency class if in anybody's interested. And this cryptocurrency class it will be a link in the description. You can hit that link and you can sign up for the class. It's a hundred dollar fee for the class. You can sign up for the class and we can start going from there. All right. So we're going to get into the world of BTC. Um, right now we pairing BTC up with the US dollar and we're using Bitstamp as the exchange, right? So let me blow this up. So first off, um, when we get into Bitcoin right now. We can see um, that we just had a three-way movement, ABC structure, ABC. This is AB stru ABC structure up, right? And in this ABC structure that we went up, um, you can put the Fibonacci to kind of like figure out where we're going to go. And this is what's interesting about um, when you put the Fib, tracement down here to the low right and you take it up we, we're going to take it up and i don't supposed to be showing y'all this but i'll let y'all see this all right so when we do that now let me blow this up all right now with the field and we blow this up we can see that from the low um to right here is point six one eight percent from the low up right and right here is where we got to right here this is right in between the point six one eight and the point five we're right in between it but we hit it right so what you want to do is now to figure out where we're going next you move the field right so now you move the field and you take it over here to where we at now depending on what you think is going to happen if you think that this three wave or abc structure to the upside is going to continue <laughs> it's going to continue basically you'll look for a target zone your target zone will basically be within the same two areas between here and there would be our target zone but i i think that this three-way structure was going to make us go downward I think we're going to come three ways down. So how you would do this is for a target zone to see where or a trend line where we think we're coming. So hold up. Let me delete this. So basically, you can see, okay, right here. That would be an area that we can look to see if we get to here or if we hit here. These are the two areas to let you know what way we're going. Now, from what I see all gate, it would be between here, put another one. Um. So in between this area and here is where I'm looking to see where we're going. Now, once I take this field ball, let me delete the field. Now let's look at the chart, right? So we know that these two areas, this is our area to know if we're continuing to going up or we're going down. Now, for one, when I look at this, we can already see that this look like this could be a three-way move down. It can look like that this could be um 
a three-way movement down because it looked like we are already coming down. So this would be similar one. Then we're going to come up somewhere within here too. And then we're going to get down to here. And that would be our three-way move downward. Um, that's that's how it can be if we're going three ways down. All right, let me um, or if we're going three way up, it would be um, we will have to start here. So we will have to start here. Go up. Hold up, y'all. Let me just delete this. I'll just delete it, do it all over again. If we're gonna go up, this is how we look, y'all. So if we were to go up, we would start from here. It'd be like a up pattern, come down. But we would have to get within this area. So it's possible that this one would break this area of support, come back down. And come up here and touch these two. This will let us know if we are, if if this trend from here is a reversal up. Um, we would it would be something similar to that. Um, we would have to get within this target zone of the Fibonacci, um, the point six and the point five retracement from this, and then from here to know. Now I think we're coming down, family. So um, this is just my personal opinion um, because of the market and the way things is looking. Um, the buying pressure will. You see how much this is. So. I personally think this is what we can expect with Bitcoin, but I could be wrong. You never know. Um, it could be, a, I think this is what we're going to see. And we're going to come up probably like within this area. And then we're going to come down and we're going to test this zone here. Touch it or either go in between these two. The complete the um pal now um that's that's short term now long term now when you want to look at bitcoin from a long long term point of view it's 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 totally different long term fifteen thousand you know, I'm hoping that all this get validated, y'all, because I have lows around 15,000 from 15, actually here, right, 15, two on up. And I hope we don't get this low. Um, the lowest is right here. I'm sorry. It's 14, 149. So 14,900 is basically where I feel like the rock bottom would be. But I'm hoping that that's not what we're seeing. And this is nothing but a big three-way structure. So it would be a one, two, and then three down. So basically, if I were to draw this big three-way structure, It'll be something like one, two, three, and then we're gonna come down. Like, um, let me change the color of this. Um, purple. Right, so. This is what I'm seeing from a from a larger point. We had a one down. We're gonna come up 
we're going to hit it, and then we're going to come back down. Now, how it may go, it may be a five-by-five, five, a five-way structure down, so it may not come straight down like that. You know, if we have that within this, we may have a five-way, a one-up, one-down, one-up, one-down, you know, then probably a three-way up, one, two, three, and then we're going to come back another five-way down, right? So within this, this is what you can expect, but – Overall, this is what I'm expecting, y'all, um, with Bitcoin, right? Now, um, I know when it comes to charts, a lot of people don't want to pay this no attention. This is the boring part where you're drawing stuff. I'm going to leave this up here. Um, I wish I could have saved it for the one hour. I'm going to delete that, though. I'll delete it. Um, and I, I try to put it on the one hour. I need to learn how to do that. I'll just save it on the one, one hour, one day different on time zones but that's what i'm expecting so long term y'all short term i'm expecting bitcoin to possibly um come up we may got a coming up today short term we may get to around where i got this at 16.8 yeah around 16 862 maybe short term but once we get there i'm expecting us to come back down y'all i'm expecting us to come down at least test this zone um because we we got here before and we went down and and we we broke it and we recovered right so and we got close to c so i'm thinking that we have to get here actually i think we need to go lower to validate it and i know you don't want to hear this but this is what i'm looking at yeah we should go lower we we should have to um we didn't make a higher high because we didn't get above here to make a higher high but we got to this area here and you can see we got here before we pushed through it But this is what I'm expecting to see for Bitcoin, y'all. Um, some news. Russia bank uh, issues a gold-backed digital financial asset. So Russia, largest bank is issuing a gold back. It's called GBG, GBD. That's a gold-backed digital. So the, uh, I think it's GBD or GBC. What is it? No, DFA. Data Digital go back digital financial assets this is the first of their kind russia is issuing it um also the news is on uh, otc trading that's over the counter trading um it's getting a lot of more traction because now people don't trust the exchanges so they're going to their old cold wallets or the um centralized i mean decentralized exchanges right or most people are just holding their stuff in their hard wallets and with that being said, y'all, uh, tell me what y'all think. Um, what y'all thoughts on Bitcoin and moving to Bitcoin? I'm expecting us a short term move up. A short term, I'm expecting us to get up, maybe to around sixteen thousand nine hundred, sixteen thousand eight hundred sixty eight, somewhere around that range. Um, but then long term, I'm expecting us to come right back down here and break this area and get to test this and see if we go lower than this. Um, that's what I'm looking at. Um, if y'all interested in the cryptocurrency class, it's the class, man. The link will be in the description. Um, until then, um, I'll talk to y'all later. Y'all enjoy the rest of y'all day. Peace and why do.